Okay, team, here's what's been happening on Ghost Rider. The facts. First, Lenny, Alex, and Jamal have a cool new friend called Ghost Rider who can do awesome things with words. And a lot of weird stuff has been going on, like kids getting their backpacks ripped off by two-faced bandits called Thabtoes. The team cracked most of the Thabtoes coded note and found out they were planning a secret ceremony. Then, Ghost Rider sent a message to Gabby. That means she's on the team, too. Now, here are some new facts from the last show. First, the Ghost Rider team found out that the Thabtoes are a four-member team who play the video game Double Defenders. Don't they have books and stuff on Double Defenders? The Double Defenders have two heads, and the Thabtoes are so into them that they wear masks with two faces and call each other by weird Double Defender names. Next, the team read books about Double Defenders, and they cracked the rest of the Thabto code. They found out that the ceremony would be Friday night at 7 o'clock in the Navy Yard. Now maybe we can get some proof straight up that the Thabtoes are the backpack thieves. So they wrote their own coded note to one of the Thabtoes telling him not to go to the ceremony. Ceremony is off. Make no contact with others until further notice. Top secret. Then, Alex crashed the secret ceremony disguised as a Thabto. But there was one problem. Which name's Alex's? I don't know. Whoa, it looks like Alex is in big trouble and things are about to get really tense. Get a pencil in your casebook out and keep track of the clues because the Ghost Rider team is on the case. And now, now we will each sign in under our chosen name. Which name is Alex's? I don't know. I don't think that Alex knows either. Jamal made it right. I think we made it. Here. 
What? Hurry up. Wait, give me the tape recorder. I'll meet you back in your place. Mr. Jenkins, this is the second time you've gone all up in our business. Wasn't that warning last week clear enough for you? You're looking to get permanently jacked up, man. All right. That makes two of us. You guys okay? Yeah, sure. How'd you get away? Man, I was like a running back, punching through the lines. Zip zap, and I was out of there. All right. Did they follow you? I don't think so. See anybody? Uh-uh. One thing I can tell you, those stab toes are pretty bugged out. Sorry about picking the wrong name, Jamal. <laughs> it's all right. I guess he just couldn't be cool for anything. Well, at least we got that chant down on tape. You listen to it yet? I just finished writing it down. Ah, great. Let's see if we can find anything more that might connect the fab toe to the backpack thieves. Ghost Rider! He's reading along. With our quarters by our side, we'll do a double defender's ride. Then the tournament will be ours. All will bow down to our powers. And know the fab toes are next to none. Two heads are better than one. Quarters, that's like money. No, Gabby, that is money. Ha ha. And they only stole money from the backpacks. Check out Double Defenders. And then the tournament will be ours. They must be talking about that double defenders tournament. You remember Alex, right? Don't worry, Master. I've got him double twisted. Watch out! Your other hand! All right, kicker, double join him! Yeah! At the arcade, tomorrow, 12 noon. So we know they'll be there. And it also says, all will bow down to our powers. Which means they plan to win. Which means lots and lots of practice. Which means lots and lots of quarters, just like it says, with our quarters by our side. That's why they stole that money from me and the other kids, to play double defenders. The fab toes are our thieves, all right. And now we know why. Got him. Look. Ghost Rider. Why is he lighting up those letters? I don't know. T-H-A-B-T-O. That spells fab toe. Right. Two heads are better than one. Two heads. Like the two-headed masks. Boy, these guys are really hung up on this double defenders game. It's like the game is real to them or something. <laughs> these guys should get a grip. They should get their heads handed to them on a platter. Stealing money just so they could practice on those Stealing two my money! I ought to make them give it back. They ought to give it back to all the kids. Look, I don't care how bugged out these stab toes are. We've got to be at the tournament tomorrow. But why would they even show up at the tournament after what happened tonight? Because double defenders is practically their life. That's why. Yeah, well, we're going to step right into it. Showdown, 12 o'clock tomorrow.
Gabby tells me that you saw the face of your robber and that you heard somebody call him Rocket Ripper. Uh-huh. Run, Rocket Ripper, run! That's him. He's the one who stole my backpack. What are you talking about? What backpack? Shoot, game's over, man. Look, we've got an important tournament, and you guys are trying to ruin it for us. Now, if you don't mind. Which one of you guys lost this great-looking button? I know it couldn't be Dan. Or could it? So two heads are better than one. <laughs> right, Thaptos? And what about all these coded messages you left in our stolen backpacks? Let me decode it for you. Neat and clean, I got away. Hey, hey. Good thing we cracked your code, guys. Otherwise, we couldn't have sent Cool Kicker a coded message so that he couldn't make it to your final ceremony. Speaking of which... With our quarters by our side. With our quarters by our side. We'll do a double defender's run. We'll do a double defender's run. And the tournament is ours. And the tournament is ours. All about down to our powers. All about down to our powers. What's the matter, guys? Can't make a move without your stupid mask on? We want our money back, Thabtoes. Yeah, we want our money back. We want our money back. Let him go. Oh, wait a minute. Have you kids got anything to say for yourselves? We just needed money for practice, for the game. We didn't take anything else from the backpacks. Didn't really hurt anyone. We're, um, double defenders players. Good players. The best. Nope. Uh-uh. You're not double defenders anything. You're not even superheroes. You're super cowards. All right, let's go. I think it's time we called your parents. Don't worry, kids. I'm sure these Thaptos will be paying your money back real soon. Man, that was great. Yes. We blasted them right out of the water. I blew the mask right off their faces. And they won't be playing double defenders again anytime soon. Or stealing again, ever, I hope. Right. You know, it was kind of tense for a moment there, wasn't it? You said it. <laughs> yeah. But we had our backup. Right. So, that's it, huh? Yep, case closed. Over and out. Well, I've got to get home anyway. <laughs> yeah, us too. We've got work to do at the store. Papa will be in this if we don't get to it. You coming, Jamal? No, that's all right. You guys go ahead. OK. See you later. Bye, Bye Jamal. Alex and 
Gabby too. He's a very good athlete, too, yeah. He started out with softball, but I think soccer is going to be his main thing. His coach says he's absolutely wonderful and, and actually probably the best soccer player he's seen in the whole school. He's got such good coordination and... <laughs> and he can play everything. I mean, he can play the piano. He's so good. He studies everything. He knows the capitals to all the states. He knew them when he was in the first grade. He's just so talented in so many ways. All the mothers are jealous of me. And I say, oh, look, you can have a Calvin, too. There's no problem. I mean, you just have to be understanding. And, you know, when he was only six, he was already reading at a seventh grade level. He used to read me bedtime stories. <laughs> And he looks so cute in his little feety pajamas with his little duty drop bottom. <laughs> Ma, well, it's the truth, dear. <laughs> Love those dimples, Calvin. See, Attila knows. Uh, yes, I'd like to get these. Oh, well, Calvin will take care of you. I've got to see to his dinner. I'm making his favorite. Tuna fish, mashed potatoes, peas, and I just mash them all together just the way he likes. Bah! Oh, honey. Now you be good. See you later. What's up, homie? Would you mind just ringing my stuff up, please? Everybody's buzzing about your Thabto capture. How did you and Alex and Lenny suddenly get so clever? <laughs> That's for uh, us to know and for you to find out. Is that a challenge? Just uh, give me my stuff, man. You're up to something. But don't try to hide it from me. I'll find out one way or another. <laughs> yeah, sure. You're brilliant, Calvin. <laughs> and I'm out of here. Well, Ghost Rider, I hope this works. Kids being picked on by big kids? Somebody in trouble? <laughs> well, not exactly. Then what is it? A surprise? More like an idea. What do you mean? Well, I was thinking about all the awesome times we've had since Ghost Rider, and I mean, if the Fabtoes are a team, why can't we be a team? Yeah. We'll be a team of young detectives. We'll wear black, dark shaded sunglasses, and we'll have miniature video cameras in our boots. <laughs> My idea wasn't quite so high tech, but uh, 
I think you'll like it. What's this? They're official Ghost Rider pins. It's great. Way cool. <laughs> we can write to Ghost Rider anytime, any place. Why don't we tell him what's going on? Let's write to him. Besides, he's on the team too. He's the whole reason for the team. I mean, we wouldn't be a team without Ghost Rider. That's right. Do you remember when we first met Ghost Rider? He was so sad and lonely. He almost went away. Yeah, I know. He didn't even know who he was. But we wrote to him and we brought him back. And now we know a lot of things about him. Tell me, I'll write him down. Okay. He cares about children. Got it. He also likes to help solve mysteries. on the case, right? You thirst for knowledge. And he's a friend. He has feelings he can't even put into words. It's so funny. What? These are things we care about, too. And that's what makes us a team. One for all, and all for one. Besides, we have our own handshake. And a rally call. We should get t-shirts. And songs. Hey, maybe if we keep on writing down everything we know about Ghost Rider, then someday we can help him solve the big mystery about who he is. Yeah. <laughs> we need a name. I know what we should call ourselves. The Ghost Rider team. Yeah! Yeah! Woo! Yeah, that's good. Hey, I've got it. Go, go. Go, go. Ghost Rider. Go, go. Go, go. What do you think? What is it? It's a notebook. I found it in the basement. Grandma says that ghosts live in memories and good old things. I say we keep everything we find out about Ghost Rider in here. Let's start with these notes that we just wrote. Go, go, Ghost Rider. This is so cool. The official Ghost Rider team book. But wait. We forgot the most important thing. What? what? And lots of adventures. All right. Hey, go with me. Put your hands in. Go. 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 Exercise your head. Read. 
Ghost Art is brought to you in part by Nike. Additional buffs that keep our team supreme come from public television viewers like you and me. The Corporation for Public Broadcasting. The John Dean Catherine T. McCarver Foundation. The Pew Charitable Trust. And the U.S. Department of Education. But you can't save all on breath. I bet you can. Ghost Rider was originally produced for the Public Broadcasting Service. Read more about Ghost Rider and the Ghost Rider team in these Bantam books. To purchase Bantam books, video cassettes, or a teacher's guide for programs in this series, contact GPN, P.O. Box 80669, Lincoln, Nebraska, 68501, or call one 800 228 4630.